What is going on guys? Welcome back to another brand new Division 2 video. In today's video, I just want to give you guys a quick update on my pretty much daily farming routine that I go through to get a lot of crafting materials and just in general a lot of loot that I can use to either uh, improve my build or just straight up sell it so that I can get um, credits or crafting materials that I can either craft a weapon or craft a piece of gear that I want or need something from or I can simply recalibrate it. So hopefully you guys do enjoy the video. If you guys do, make sure you guys drop a like and a subscribe channel if you guys are new. And let's get right into the video. All right guys, so getting right into it, uh, I'm gonna show you guys the route that I pretty much use just real quick. You guys will see it later in the video. Once again, when I'm pretty much just doing it live, it'll, it takes me around 25 to 35 minutes. Uh, sometimes I do spend a little bit more time because uh, I like exploring the range around here a little bit more. And just seeing if there's something that maybe is uh, is in the path of this rotation for farming that I do. And maybe I can add it and maybe I do not decide to add it. Um, but first off, obviously I start at the sinkhole control point. I don't really care what level it is. Uh, the main thing is I just try to complete as fast as I can so that I can talk to the JTF officer or whatever. And then activate the threat detection level 2 so that I can see um, all the loot from a super, super far distance. So that I know, I know I'm not missing anything. So... Uh, pretty much after I complete the control point for sinkhole, uh, I pretty much go around the control point and loot everything that I can. And I keep on going straight, and I go and grab these components right here that are kind of close to the control point. They're pretty much next to the control point, and I loot all that around there. Uh, but this control point right here, the solar farm, I'll zoom out a little bit more so you guys can see it. Uh, the solar farm control point is definitely uh, the control point that you want to do the most of if you have time because this has the most loot and it definitely has the most crafting materials in general. Uh, there are a couple of we weapon boxes that you guys will see me grab um, if you do watch the video to the end to see me actually doing the, the run live. Um, but the solar farm has the most loot. Um, I will say though quickly right now, it is a little bit flunky in terms of uh, the crafting materials you get. Um, usually I get a lot more electronics, which I would have wanted before, mainly, honestly. I would have wanted a lot more electronics. Um, but now I have a problem getting uh, a couple of other different crafting materials as well, and I'm not really having a problem uh, with getting the electronics. More or less, it's uh, ceramics right now that I'm having a problem with. Uh, obviously, once I finish the first control point, I go to the components, grab those, go to the solar farm, and then I go, you can see this little green dot. It's because I already grabbed these components and they haven't reset yet. Um, actually you just saw it reset live um, but I go right here and sometimes there is a boss that spawns right here uh, it doesn't happen every time maybe every couple of days a boss spawns there that I haven't gotten already um, so just be aware of that if you do see some random enemies that are spawned there um, it's most likely going to be a boss and there are a couple of weapon boxes as well if you guys are looking for weapons or just looking for stuff to sell then obviously you may find a couple of things you want from there, but obviously I just point this out because it's components and you need a lot of components in the game as of right now. Also, for just the sake of this video, uh, if you guys don't know what the threat detection is or just the detection is in the game, uh, if you go to the base of operations and you go to the perks section, uh, you see that you have detection 1 and detection 2. Donating enough resources to the control point activities, uh, better detection of loot containers in a 20 meter radius for 10 minutes, and then obviously threat detection too, you just automatically get that. Um, but I just want to throw it out there because some people might not know what it is. And um, then also, before I do switch over to uh, pretty much the live stream or live gameplay that you guys see of me doing the farm uh, live, I guess, uh, I'll just show you guys my resources so you don't think I'm like faking or anything or lying. Uh, 33 receiver components, uh, obviously I'm max on fabric, uh, 233 steel, 375 carbon fiber, 250 polycarbonate, only 98 ceramics because I just did some recals last night, uh, 280 electronics. Like I said before, for some reason it was flip-flopped. I always had max ceramics. I had no electronics. Now I have a ton of electronics and I have no ceramics because uh, the more you upgrade your weapons and the more you upgrade your gear in terms of recalibrations, uh, it costs more ceramics, obviously. 198 titanium. Uh, I actually crafted some assault rifles to do a weekly assignment yesterday. And then obviously I'm still maxed out on a hundred printer filament. I just want to throw that out there because some people might think I'm lying in terms of the loot that I get and the crafting materials that I get from every single time that I do this farming method. But like I said, guys, uh, this farming method does take me around 25 to 35 minutes uh, every single time I do it. Although I am doing it solo, so I don't know if that really adds any time or not. Uh, mostly it depends on whether or not my control points are saved from the day before, meaning 
uh, if I took them over the day before when I did my control points and my daily farming. Um, I get back on the next day to do it again after everything refreshes. Uh, sometimes the control points are still taken over and sometimes they're not taken over. Sometimes they're even in the process of being taken over. So I guess if you're speaking in terms of the two control points being done already, um, I guess I could take away like maybe five or ten minutes away from it. Uh, but I've done it so many times that I have it memorized where everything is that I need, all the weapon boxes, all the gear boxes, um, and everything that I need is memorized in my head. Uh, so I guess that's a little bit partially the reason why I get it done so fast. But uh, yeah, uh, the next 30 minutes or so of the video is just going to be the live gameplay of me going through and farming everything so that you guys can actually physically see uh, the method that I use to farm and actually see how many crafting materials and how many weapons and gear, pieces of gear I should say, that I do actually get. Uh, but yeah, hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Catch you guys next one. Peace out. All right, guys. So quickly, to show you my resources before we start. Uh, really, I only care about these two, to be honest, ceramics and electronics. So just remember we had 104 ceramics and 280 electronics. So that's really the only thing that I mainly care about right now. Fortunately, all of the control points that I normally use are all taken over. So we're going to have to redo all of them. Well, the two of them. Although it looks like this one was already starting to be attacked. So. I think it may have just activated from when I was uh, AFK over here. Man, they just love giving me fat packs to me. And they ha li it literally has the perfect counts I want. Hardened and on the ropes, dude. This is... Despicable. So they shoot. I just need an AR mainly that has okay, that's not what I wanted. Yeah, that's not what I wanted. Two so cloth mask. Thank you. Grab some ammo real quick. Not that we're gonna probably ever need it, but Ooh. 
everything's good with you, Agent. We're running low on supplies. Sorry, active. Nope. Probably not even gonna activate it after I donate all these, I bet. 50 bucks. I freaking knew it, dude. I freaking knew it. <laughs> Even if I sit here and wait for a second, I can actually get it to activate. We could really use your help. <laughs> well, I guess we'll try the next one. Although I know where most of the stuff is that I want around here, so I'll be able to grab that. This is always the most annoying thing to jump on top of. Come on. That's pretty much everything over here that I grab. I go over here. This weapon box. They did nerf this farming method a little bit, but they didn't nerf it to where it's like not even useful anymore. It's, it's definitely still decent. Mainly, I just want ceramics. It's just kind of wishy-washy in terms of what you get from the what I call them electronic boxes. Oh, these ones right here. Sometimes you get ceramics. Sometimes you get electronics. this threat detection thing would have came in handy because there's going to be some stuff I'm going to probably miss. Although I didn't catch that box. There's actually probably a couple that I've missed. Here. This one used to always give you a high end. Let's see if it actually does. Oh. Always used to give you a high end, and then I think they nerfed that. Hi, dog. Hi, dog. Just writing my threat. I'm gonna miss a ton of stuff. Here. 
Yeah, this is where I'm gonna miss a lot of them because it's dark over here. I can't really see much. Do need components though. Do you need these? Just for a quick reference, if you guys were wondering where I was at, uh, why I talked about this one earlier, that's that's where I'm at. I'm like in between them, pretty much. In between the two control points. have these all memorized where everything spawns, which is kind of sad. That health I'm killed, though. That might be better than what I have already. Not 100% sure of that. Definitely a couple things that I missed in the middle of sections. Maybe not. Supplies nearby. These are some on top too, right? Oh, it's just crazy, I guess. You know there's a box over here somewhere, I think. No? Oh, here it is. I was gonna say, I know there's a box over here. What is that? Okay. That's what all I came over here for. Moldy holding gloves are what I want because it always has one attribute on it that's really high. Because I need assault rifle damage. You know, there's a couple more things down here that I need to grab real quick. Right here. Actually, it's just a uh, ammo box down there. I always forget. Here's the checkpoint. It's got all the goods. Or the control point's got all the goods. All the stuff that I used to need that I don't want. Supplies nearby. They love giving me things.
Okay, my backpack talent actually worked. It didn't use my, uh... My first day. gonna annoy me because there's a, a side mission thing. stupid thing next to it. It's annoying. I hate when this happens. Did I never finish that resource convoy? So you just okay. So you just spawn a random fucking God, this pisses me off. Why are you even here? Why are you on my ass? Get off of me. All I'm trying to do is complete this control plane. I got all these stupid fucking side missions. You're gonna stand behind that cover for 35 seconds as soon as I start shooting. Pick it up. Oh my gosh. After we just wasted an extra 10 minutes. All the stuff I get are the pieces I don't want. 
or don't eat for some time. Come on. I don't know why this game brings so laggy and glitchy. You need anything. If you can lend a hand, we'd be grateful. So are they really gonna do this to me? She's not gonna activate this. I don't need two hundred components. Well, fuck you too, Batman. Yeah, roll these balloons for us. I do remember missing that though, so I'd come back and get that. Go up the right side first. I think I already grabbed it. No, did I not grab the stuff? Or did I? Well, I grabbed the stuff already. Apparently not. I can't forget about this box. There's a box over here. Oh, here's the. Is this the or something like this? Something. Any help you could provide would mean a lot. For the amount of stuff I donated and not gotten this active still is actually insane. Forget about this though, I do know there's a gun that spawns right here. I know. And it doesn't have talents I want. Or that I need. Alright. See if we get lucky enough to spawn a boss again here. Hostiles guarding location nearby. Uh, maybe. It's actually something that spawned here. bad that I know where all this stuff is. This is that something was just spawned over here.
Oh, it's just kill party control. Right here. I can never remember where this one box is here. Right here? No? Oh, here it is. Okay. I was gonna say, I know a box is here, I can just never remember it is here. Alright, I know for a fact there's a couple of things I did miss in here though. They're in the middle. I'm probably gonna miss all of them. And I know there's more. Yeah, there's all our receiver components back that we just used. Alright, just last run through right here, see if we missed anything. Uh, just under 30 minutes, dude. Like I said, 28 minutes. Probably would have cut 10 minutes of that back, but yeah, we got a ton of ceramics. What I have, I had 103 ceramics, so we got pretty much 200 ceramics. We got 180 electronics. Well, yeah, pretty much 180 or 100, I should say, because I had 280. Got a ton of titanium. We maxed out these two, pretty much that one too. So. Pretty much maxed out three of our resources, and we got Agent in need of 180 ceramics in 30 minutes. I mean, I would, I would consider that pretty good if that was me. Plus, we got, uh, like I said, I usually break go through like this, and then I'll deconstruct that, that, that. I'm gonna keep that providence mask. That. I don't think I can see that. Don't need that. You just go down, break down all this, and then. Ugh! It had rifle damage on it. Damn it. All of these have rifle damage. Keep an effort on the ropes. my backpack have right now? Armor. Alright, so let's see how much uh, ceramics we get from all this. Or if we get any at all. There you go, another 58 ceramics. So, in total, that put us to 338. So we went from 100 to 338. So we got almost 
250 ceramics almost in 30 minutes. I would consider that pretty good if that was me personally. That's pretty much like two recals right there, depending on what you're recaling. But uh, yeah, there's the final take. I mean, you guys can literally see it. So yeah, thanks for watching, guys. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Thank you.